There are misconceptions, myths, and rumors out there. Reality Check will investigate these myths and find out what is the real story. So anyway, I'm trying to get out of here on time on Friday because I've got some stuff I've got to do. And I'm trying to figure out, you know, I walk every day. I think uh -huh. that's probably faster than the bus. I don't know. I, mean, I, I take the bus every day and I'm, I'm pretty confident that I can beat the walkers on almost every day. You really think so? I do. I don't know. I walk pretty fast. You know, it'd be cool if we could do a test and figure it out and see which really is faster. Stopwatches, time it. Get some volunteers. Yeah. Maybe do it on averages so that we, you know, do a couple days, see what, what the results really are. That'd be great. Sounds good to me. Yeah. Let's try it. Nick and Mary Kay enlisted the help of three volunteers, Rebecca, Reese, and Stephen, each equipped with a stopwatch and map. They walked from the bus stop on JPA across from Jordan Hall to the upper bus stop at Scott Stadium, timing themselves as they went, each taking the same route. The next day, they walked from the same bus stop at JPA to the bottom parking lot of U-Haul. Nick and Mary Kay averaged their times to account for varying walking speeds. Then each volunteer timed their bus ride for three days. Because traffic can play a role in the evening commute, each volunteer rode at different times. Rebecca rode at 4.30, Reese chose 5 p.m., Stephen rode at 5.30. So for the 4.30 three-day average, riding the bus from the bus stop on JP to U-Haul, it took an average of 12 minutes and 13 seconds. For five o'clock, for the same trip, it took 14 minutes and 17 seconds. 14, 17? 14, 17. And at 5.30, 16 minutes, 19 seconds. 16 minutes and 19 seconds? That's correct. So when you look at these averages, Average walk time was 21 minutes and 10 seconds. Average ride time, every time was? Much faster than riding a bus by five minutes. Moving on to Scott Stadium, we had our same volunteers, Rebecca, Steve, and Reese, help us out. They walked from the same bus stop on JPA to a bus stop at the Scott Stadium parking lot. And it took Rebecca 13 minutes, 37 seconds, Steve, 15, 51, and Reese, 17, 19, for an average walk time of? 15 minutes and 35 seconds. Okay, then we did the same thing with the bus. We did a 4.30, 5, and 5.30. Average walk ride times were 8.46, 10.09, and 11.03. So again, our results show... It's faster to take the bus. So Mary Kay, the results are in, and it's faster to ride the bus than it is to walk. I know, you were right. I am sometimes. Yeah, every now and then. But let's talk about some of the benefits of walking that may have gotten hidden in our study. Well, we know that it's obviously healthier to walk than to ride. And it's nice outside, so you get to enjoy nature. And for me, it's a de-stressor. And for only a five minute difference in commute time, it might really be worth it. So I think so. I think in the future, I might give walking a chance. I think that's a good idea. So there you have it, folks. Click on the article and you'll find more of the results. There are misconceptions, myths, and rumors. We've set out to find out the reality in each case.